All right, guys, there is one thing in fitness that I cannot stress enough, and it's that an exercise can be a beginner, intermediate, or an advanced move or movement or exercise. It just depends on how you use it. For example, like an air squat, a lot of people would say, oh, an air squat is a beginner move. And it is if you use it as a teaching mechanism to teach someone the mechanics of a squat. You're not using any weight, they're just learning, oh, my hips go back, I'm pressing through my heels, my chest stays up. It can be an intermediate move by working it into your workout. So maybe you do some weighted squats and then you finish it off as a drop set with air squats. That'd be an intermediate way of using it. An advanced way of using it would be how can I make this exercise more challenging without adding anything to it? And it's very easy to do. So an advanced, I guess, way of looking at it would be, okay, I'm gonna do 100 air squats unbroken. That's a very hard thing to do. I've done it before. It's very, very hard. But you need to start thinking of exercises as it doesn't get more challenging by the uh, weight you add. That's a very narrow way of thinking. Start looking at exercises and being like, how can I make this more challenging with only body weight or with very light weight and learn how to push your body in those different ways.